Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Obsessive Compulsive Gaming. I am the Obsessive Compulsive Gamer, joined once again by my faithful manservant, Bertram. Say hello, Bertram. Hello, Bertram. And this is our review for Itadaki Smash. So, dear viewer, don't you dare forget to subscribe to this channel and like this video. Itadaki Smash, no relation to Hulk Smash, was released in 2021. A year I remember fondly as the year I... Uh... I... Oh... I can't remember. Um, wasn't that the year you fell on your head while trying to do a handstand? I have no bloody idea. I can't remember anything about 2021. Oh, you probably have gonorrhea. I think you mean amnesia, Bartram. Oh. Anyway. That's when this bloody game came out, and I know exactly what you're thinking. What is this? I'm so glad you asked, Barry Burton. Itadaki Smash is one of those beat-em-up things that are rather like Henry VIII's wives. You kill one, and then another bloody one comes along. Uh, technically, you can't kill a video game. Oh, yes, you can. Don't you remember the funeral we had for Babylon Spall? Oh! May it rest in peace. Anyway, Itadaki Smash is yet another beat em up. Not a very good one. Therefore, I declare that. Um. Is there really nothing else you can tell us about the game? No. Really? <sighs> oh, fine. Instead of beating up the standard common fodder, like gang members or prostitutes who can juggle puppies, in this game, you fight giant bow buns, onions, and other food-looking people for reasons. It's as silly as Bertram wearing a cap back to front. Uh, I was 12 when I did that. And that's why you were a very silly-looking 12-year-old Bertram. Anyway, you fight food things. You beat up food things. You move through stages in which you'll encounter food things. And every four stages, you fight a boss and retrieve recipe cards. Or some such cow shit. Like I said, this isn't a very good example of the genre. Therefore, I declare that Itadaki Smash is dog shit. So... There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, our review for Itadaki Smash. If you enjoyed this little review of mine, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And don't you dare forget to subscribe to this channel, to like this video, and turn on the bloody notifications. But, remember the single most important thing I always tell you, dear viewer, and that is to always stay obsessed with gaming. Say goodbye, Bertram. Goodbye, Bertram. Are you still here? Oh, you must have really enjoyed this video then. In that case, you had better subscribe to the channel and check out our other content. Otherwise, you're a booby pads. And no one wants to be a booby pads.